This illustration is about an analysis of a block breaking off from ground. Here the figure shows two blocks A and B with block A attached to a spring of natural length L and force constant K. And here the system is released from the state shown in figure with the spring vertical. We are required to find the displacement of block A on ground before it breaks off from the ground. Now as block B slides down A moves to a right, then at the point of breaking off, let us draw the picture once again to understand the situation. Say if block B has fallen by some distance and block A also is displaced toward right by some distance, due to which here we can see the spring gets elongated and gets inclined like this. This length is L. And say if this angle is theta to which a spring is inclined, due to elongation of a spring, this will apply a force K Y on block A, if Y is the elongation in a spring. Then in upward direction this angle is theta, the force acting on the block will be K Y cos theta. So if K Y cos theta becomes more than the weight of this block A, this will break off from ground. So, here we can write for breaking off from ground, we should use k y cos theta should be equals to m g that is here equation 1 and say the block is displaced to a right by a distance x. Then in this situation, this length can be written as l sec theta. So, here we can Calculate the elongation in a spring if this position is say c, then elongation in a spring at position c is this y can be written as this l sec theta minus l. So this l multiplied by sec theta minus one. This is the elongation in a spring. Now from equation one we can write. Here we are having ky cos theta is mg. If we substitute the value of y, this is k times l sec theta minus 1 multiplied by cos theta is equals to mg. On simplifying this, kl1 minus cos theta is equals to mg. Or the value of cos theta we are getting here is 1 minus mg by kl. So, if we have got the value of cos theta trigonometrically, we can get the value of tan theta by drawing a triangle if this angle is theta. So, in this situation, cos theta is this by this. So, we can consider this as 1 minus mg upon kl and this 1. So, tan theta also you can calculate, which can be given as root of 1 minus or 1 minus mg upon kl whole square divided by 1 minus mg by k. If this is the value of tan theta, we can directly get the value of x as here tan theta can also be written as x by l. And here we are required to find the value of x, the displacement of block a when it breaks off. So, this gives us the value of x as this l times tan theta or further simplifying this will give us l under the root k square l square minus k l minus m g whole square divided by k l minus m g. So, this is the final result of the problem, the displacement of block a when it breaks off from the ground.